During the state opening of Parliament, King Charles and Camilla adorned themselves with astonishing jewels worth £4.1 billion. Hi! Before we continue please subscribe to the channel for more updates. King Charles and Queen Camilla will adorn themselves with an awe-inspiring array of jewels, valued at a staggering £4.1 billion, as they grace the grand occasion of the state opening of Parliament. Today, within the majestic walls of the Palace of Westminster, the royal couple will showcase some of the most renowned treasures from the royal jewellery collection. In the hallowed chamber of the House of Lords, on this extraordinary day that marks the commencement of a new parliamentary session, King Charles, who ascended the throne after the recent election that saw Sir Keir Starmer become Prime Minister, will deliver his state opening speech once more. And standing steadfastly by his side, Queen Camilla will radiate regal elegance, among the glittering ensemble of jewels, the imperial state crown will take center stage, its resplendent glory reminiscent of the one worn by Queen Elizabeth II during her own state opening speeches. This very crown, a symbol of majestic authority, also adorned King Charles during his momentous coronation ceremony. Today, as the king and queen of the realm bedeck themselves in these priceless gems, they embody the timeless splendor and rich heritage of the royal family, captivating all who witness their majestic presence. The resplendent imperial state crown, a magnificent amalgamation of gold, silver, and platinum, is bedecked with a staggering array of precious gemstones. Adorned with a breathtaking ensemble of 2,868 diamonds, 269 pearls, 17 sapphires, and 11 emeralds, this regal masterpiece is the epitome of opulence. This crown, steeped in grandeur and history, is most famously donned by the newly anointed monarch as they emerge from the hallowed halls of Westminster Abbey. It is a sight to behold, with the king proudly wearing it during the royal family's triumphant appearance on the balcony after their coronation in May 2023. While its association with coronations is well known, the imperial state crown is not limited to such occasions. It carries within its majestic form a rich tapestry of royal heritage. At its pinnacle rests the St. Edward's Sapphire, a gem believed to have originated during the Norman Conquest in 1066. This legendary sapphire, once set in a ring worn by Edward the Confessor, was discovered within his tomb in 1163, adding an air of mystique and antiquity to the crown. Among its other illustrious adornments, the imperial state crown boasts the Black Prince's ruby, the Stuart sapphire, and the awe-inspiring Cullinan II diamond. These precious gems, each with their own captivating history, further enhance the regal splendor of this extraordinary crown. Valued at a staggering £3.5 billion, the imperial state crown stands as a testament to unrivaled craftsmanship and unrivaled beauty. However, the queen herself will not be overshadowed, as she will grace the occasion with her own remarkable headpiece. The iconic diamond diadem, famously worn by the late Queen Elizabeth and immortalized on British stamps from 1953 to 1971, will adorn her majestic presence. This diadem, resplendent with 1,333 brilliant cut diamonds, possesses a dazzling radiance that captivates all who behold it. Its intricate design incorporates a four-carat yellow diamond at the forefront and features the national emblems of the thistle, shamrock, and rose. Passed down through generations of royals, this priceless piece of history is estimated to be worth around £6 million, a testament to its enduring beauty and historical significance. As jewellery expert Maxwell Stone from Stephen Stone aptly remarked, if the king and queen choose to wear these anticipated diamond headpieces for the state opening of parliament, they will be adorned with a staggering £4.1 billion worth of jewels. A truly awe-inspiring display of regal magnificence. Thank you for watching till the end. Please do share your thoughts in the comments section and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more updates.